Hi guys this is Sieg QG35 Security today I will show you how to backup Windows 10 to 1H2 on SSTR. Explain. To backup Windows 10x86.6421 H2 on. WinPE11108 Sergey Strelik x86.64 EN. You need to use a Cronus True Image 2019 build 17750 in the Programs WinPE to select Disk Partition MBR or FE on Windows 10. You need to follow step by step to completed backup Windows 10 to 1H2. Go to Startup. Type info. Run as administrator. Click Yes. BIOS mode is only legacy MBR on Windows 10. Close the system information. Go to PC right click and select properties. Type of Windows 10 is 64 bit operation system x64 based processor. Close the settings. Let's reboot the system to AIO boot and boot up WinPE SSTR. So we can start backup Windows 10. After done boot up WinPE 10 Strelic 10x64, N. Go to Startup. Go to Programs WinPE. Go to Backup and Restore. Select a Cronus True Image 2019 build 17750. Select Backup My Disk Files and Folders. The NTFS and labeled C. Disk and NTFS System Reserved F. Disk is selected already to backup Windows 10 to 1H2 with BCD boot. You can add FAT32 UEFIG disk to extra backup boot up to Windows 10. Click Next. Create new backup archive then click Browser then select AIOBOOTE disk. Click Create new folder. Rename and type image True.19. Click OK. Click Generate Name for Format File Tib. Rename my backup to WIN10, a.19 then click OK. Click Next. The Partition 4 of Disk is already selected to start backup Windows 10 Disk C. Include NTFS System Reserved and FAT32 UEFI. Click Proceed to start backup Windows 10. It's now start to backup Windows 10 to 1H2 it will take 30 or 50 minutes to complete the backup Windows 10 with EFI files. After done the backup Windows 10 to 1H2 successfully. Click OK. Now let's recovery Windows 10 to 1H2 MBR and UEFI. You backup on AIOBOOTE disk. Select recovery my disk files and folders. Select Win 10, a.19. You can check with browser if is not shown on the image files. Click Next. Click Next. Select the NTFS Windows 10 and labeled C. Disk with NTFS System Reserved F. Disk and FAT32 UEFIG. Disk. Click Next. All specify recovery settings of partition FCG disk will select it on. Disk 1 it will be deleted all local disk and replace Windows 10 plus FE on recovery system. Click Next. Now it's already partition disk selected for recovery local disk 1. Include CFG disk it will be restore Windows 10 to 1 H2 system files. Click Proceed to start restore Windows 10. It's now start to restore Windows 10 to 1H2 it will take 30 or 50 minutes to complete the recovery Windows 10 with EFI files. After done the restore Windows 10 to 1H2 successfully. Click OK. 
Close Acronis True Image 2019 Build 17750. Let's reboot WinPE SSTR. Boot Windows 1021H2. Hopefully you enjoy the video with the guide it's now backup Windows 1021H2 MBR on disk for recovery system. Don't forget like subscribe and share with yours friends. Thank you for watching.